Python ate the pancake. The python couldn't bear to eat the man again, so it sent the man out of the cave. With the help of the python, the man quickly escaped outside the cave. The python thought the boy would give him another pancake, but the boy just waved and left, and that made the python ponder. As the boy walked on, suddenly there was a noise in the bushes. The boy was terrified. The next moment, a wolf popped out of the bushes. The boy climbed up a tree. The old wolf was barking under the tree. The boy took out his flute and played it. The wolf turns into a husky. He was so happy that he crashed into the old tree. The tree shook and the boy fell onto the wolf. At that moment, the wolf's stomach growled with hunger. The boy hurriedly took out a piece of pancake. Otherwise, he might be the one to be eaten. The wolf thanked the man for the pancake. He even gave him a ride. Late at night, he saw a house on the lake. The boy got off the wolf and went to stay there. What he didn't know was that it was inhabited by an old man-eating witch. When the boy arrived, the old hag had disguised herself as a beautiful woman. He didn't realize he'd be offered a meal. The boy sat down. The beauty slapped her hands together, and the furniture tied the boy up. Because the beauty had prepared a pot of boiling water for him, the boy wanted to play his flute before he died. The beauty, who had always been kind to people, naturally agreed. But as soon as the boy's flute sounded, his body twisted uncontrollably. The rest of the furniture followed suit. But the beautiful girl got carried away. She took off her coat. And in an instant, she became an old hag. The boy was horrified. The old hag threw off her coat. And the old dead tree was full of life and fruit. 